Hey guys, welcome to episode 32 of The Long Dark on Stalker Difficulty. Let's go ahead and resume our game. Uh, when last we left off, we were in the middle of a cave in Ash Canyon. And uh, we had a rope climb ahead of us. So I went ahead and slept here for an hour just to uh, save our game. Okay, so we've got a rope climb ahead of us, but we are a bit heavy. Oh, I didn't even notice this deer before. Was this here before? Wow, I like walked completely around that. I totally missed that. Crazy. Okay. Um, we could cook that up. You know, I have to drop a ton of wood anyway. And, uh, uh, I don't know. Let's get a fire started either way. Uh, do we have a torch? Yeah, we do have a torch. So that's good. Go ahead and light that. Okay, so we are facing some options here. You can go up the uh, rope here. I think we're on the right track. Um, so I think that's probably what we'll do. We are out of tinder. We are out of tinder, guys. Okay, well, that means I gotta craft up some tinder. How long does it take to craft a stick into tinder? Might have to put out our torch here. So if we harvest that, it takes five minutes. Yeah, let's go ahead and see if our torch survives. It's five minutes of making some tinder here. Yeah, it's all right. Okay, let's go ahead and start a fire. We do have some tinder. Let's use our torch. If we can get our fire making skills leveled up, then we wouldn't need tinder anymore. I'm not sure what level that is. Might be. Come on, little fire. Come on. Might be level two. I can't remember. Okay, we got the fire started. That's good. Here we go. Fire starting skill level three. We'll check that out in just a minute. Let's add some fuel to this. We have any? We got some sticks. Okay. And didn't we pick up? Yeah, I was gonna say. I thought there was a bunch of wood around here also. So we could add that to it. Um, may as well cook some water. I mean, we don't need water, but I'm going to harvest a little bit of this food, I think. Okay, so that's going to take uh, probably about a half hour. So let's see if there's any meat on here. Yeah, that should be all right. Um, I think we'll be okay with the uh, fire not going out if we do that. I'll just start with the meat though. How's the water looking? Okay, we got some venison for breakfast. Honey piece right here. Okay, so we got 37 minutes there, 35 minutes. Let's check out the hide on this. Can we harvest the hide? Yeah. Not like we really need the hide. As far as guts go, let's check on our food. Three minutes, okay. Alright, let's drink up. Let's see what kind of drinks we have. 
got coffee and some herbal tea. I'll save that. And a couple of reishi teas. So I'll just drink some water. Okay, let's drop our hide that we picked up. And we didn't get any guts yet, right? Okay. I don't think I really need the guts. But it, it did just take like a minute, right? How long was that? 18 minutes. What the heck? Go ahead and get those curing. There's a chance we might be back through here and we might need them in the future. And I think they can cure here. Yeah, they can go ahead and cure. Right here by the fire. Okay, now what time of day is it? It is getting late. Um, I wouldn't mind climbing to the top of the rope just to see what's up there. But there's a good chance we will sleep, you know, get fully rested before we continue venturing on. So let's uh, drop a bunch of stuff so we're light. Drop one of those. Drop some coal. Yeah, we're still just a little bit heavy. How much water do we have? 2.48 liters. Let's drop half a liter. And now we're light. Okay. Don't think we can get a torch up there, so I'm just going to climb up the. Just go ahead and climb up here, I guess. All right. Here it goes. Okay, we make it. Okay, looks like we made it. Oh, we got a blue flare up here. That's good. Green flare. Looks like we got a an exit right there of some kind. So I wonder if this loops over there. Yeah, looks like we might be able to get over there from here. Okay, is there anything worth coming over here for? Oh, we got a guy and an animal. Got a dead guy and a wolf. Anything over here? All right. Huh. Wonder what the story was here. Who died first? The wolf looks like he's uh, been ravaged, so I'm guessing this guy died first. No, no, the wolf died first, and this guy ate the wolf. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, let's have a look and see what he has. Beef jerky. That's weird. He ate the wolf when he had beef jerky. Now, I don't really want any wolf meat. Uh, I probably shouldn't have clicked on him. By clicking on him, then it's going to start a timer where he's going to disappear. Just too bad. So now I kind of feel like I have to. Um, let's harvest up his meat. We can drop it outside. If we're ever back this way, we could eat the the meat. Don't really need the hide or the guts. How long is it? Let's see. Four minutes, thirteen minutes, twenty-two minutes. Um, oh, and I definitely don't want to harvest when I have the lantern lit. That would have been bad. Um, let's just get the meat for now. I think we did pick up some lantern fuel, maybe? So I'm going to see if I can reload our lantern, refuel it. Refuel, yeah, we have just a little bit. 
So we're almost up to half full on our lantern now. Okay. Let's uh, have a look around again. I'm not missing anything, am I? There's no loot over here. Okay. And back the way we came. Well run. We've got a whole night ahead of us. Okay, we've got an exit here. We'll uh, peek out and see what the exit looks like. Let's go ahead and drop our food while I'm thinking of it. I do not want to attract more uh, wolves than we already have. Let's have a look around. I wonder if we can map this. Uh, I'm going to try to map by the cave here. If we can get the cave on our map. Okay, there we go. Got the valley down below us. I'm going to leave those rose hips for the future. Have a bit of a look over the ledge here. I'm guessing we made our way through there. And uh, hey, we got a, we got a couple of bridges. Looks like, you know, I'm just gonna leave the uh, the cave. There's nothing. We don't really need anything in there. What time of day is it? It is getting late. Hmm. So there's a chance we could be coming back here to spend the night. But I'm gonna press on. Let's get a torch out. I just don't know what to expect up here. How did that wolf even get up there with that guy? You know, he must have come across this bridge. That's a little nerve wracking. Got a climbing rope. Sure now we're super heavy. I think there's another, another bridge over that way. I'm gonna map this and see what we can see here. Not showing a whole lot. So can we go this way too? No, it looks like a dead end. All right. This looks awfully rickety. I wonder who even built this. This must be like the miners, I guess. I wonder how many people died just trying to build that. That's pretty treacherous. Right, let's get out our slayer. Well, it is a nice clear evening. That is, that is good. Got, uh, oh, I got some rabbits. Got some of these maples, birch. Got some birch saplings. Uh, oh, you know what? We never dropped the birch. Uh, I think I'm carrying some stuff, aren't I? Yeah, I've got some birch right here. Um, don't know when we'll be inside again. Should I, you know, I'm not even going to bother with these. I don't know where to put them. That's the problem. I don't know where to put them to cure. We're already a little bit heavy, and so I'm <laughs> gonna pick up a stick, of course. Hey, rabbits. I'm gonna just let you guys do your thing. What do we have here? We got a fish. Okay. Ruined rainbow trout. We've got a hatchet. Oh, lucky day! It's eighty-two percent. Can't let that go. Broken arrow. We'll take that for the arrowhead. Got some chips and no charcoal. 
I kind of want to take this. I mean, we could just start a fire real quick and try to eat it. Um, let's see how long it takes to cook this. And of course, we're out of tinder again. Oh yeah, we were gonna look at the fire starting level three. What did that do for us? Fire starting level three. Uh, you have well above average experience in starting fires now. You're becoming very capable. 65% chance to start fires. Fires last 10% longer. You can start fires without tinder. We don't even need tinder now. Okay, so optional. There we go. All right, let's uh, start a fire without tinder. That's nice. Come on, little fire. So I can hear those crows off to the side. Is that do we have a carcass to check out here? Perfect. Where are the crows? They might be. They might be down below us. Is what I was trying to say. Um, all right, let's. See how long it takes to cook this guy. An hour. Um, might need to find some more torches or some more sticks. Let's have a peek over the edge here. Whoa. There they are. There must be a corpse way down there. Way down. <laughs> Let's see if I can get some more sticks real quick. There's one. Hey, rabbit. Seen any sticks around here? There's a couple more. Might as well grab a rabbit. We're already cooking up fish for an hour. Thanks, little guy. I'm sure you'll be delicious. Alright, let's add a little bit more fuel here. Let's check this rabbit. Not a whole lot of nutrients there, that's for sure. Just barely have enough uh, fuel there. All right, so in a half an hour, let's see what we can do. Can we harvest, get the hide while the guts are both. It's only nine minutes for the guts. Or 36 minutes by hand. Wow. All right, we'll get the guts. Let's check on this. That's a pretty good meal. I could uh, top it off with some water. We probably won't be able to finish the water before the fire goes out. But that's all right. So we got 15 minutes. Yeah, we don't really need the 
Don't really need this stuff. Drop that. I'm gonna drop these sticks here. We also have a shirt I think we can harvest. Yeah, we got this guy here. 45 minutes. Huh? I think I'll save that till we're inside. Can drop whatever we just picked up. Is that uh, melted snow? And drop that. Okay. Well, that was good. We uh, got a full belly out of that. How are we doing for our health? Wonder if it will let me eat another pill. if that did anything. Doses remaining six of ten doses. Okay. Alright, well, let's press on. Did we get any charcoal out of that? Sounds like a storm kicking up. Uh, is this the right way? I don't think we can go this way, guys. So, what does that mean? Um, is this just a dead end? don't think I want to go down. And why am I heavy? It's just, maybe because I'm tired? Okay, I'm really not sure where to go here. Now, is it back this way? I think this might be the right way. <sighs> so, is that just a dead end? Looks like a dead end that way. The bridge. This looks a little sketchy. Wow. <laughs> oh no. Oh, it's getting dark out here. Oh hey, it got some matches. It's a very nice view. Uh, okay, I'm gonna map from here. Since it's a nice clear night. What do we have? Uh, I get, have we already been across this bridge? I can't remember. I don't think so. This looks awfully shaky. I think I would remember. I'm not going to look down. Okay, I'm looking down. Whoa. That is freaky. Freaky old bridge. Oh my gosh, guy. <laughs> it's trippy. Right as the wind kicks up. Uh, why can't I move? It does, this is getting my heart racing just a little bit. Going across that. <laughs> yeah. A little bit scary there. Alright, so this is probably a dead end right here. I'm just peeking over the edge. Yeah, I think that's just dead end. Well, I hope we don't get stuck out. Maybe I shouldn't jinx, jinx myself. But uh, I was going to say, I hope we don't get stuck on a ledge over here with a storm brewing. Um, should I drink a coffee? No. I do want to sleep. Uh, I just need to make sure it's a safe place.
There's a dead end right here. Okay. Oh, I got the moon coming up. What do we have here? Nothing. Yeah, I really want to find somewhere to sleep. We got some maples and a sign. Uh, I'm gonna leave the maples. Like I said, you know, I don't know where we can cure those. This way, I guess. I mean, it doesn't say anything, but it's, it looks like an arrow. can hear wolves. Let's get our get a flare out just in case. It's very cool ambient. Oh, look at that. That looks like a howling wolf. I wonder if they meant to do that. Howling wolf rock. Right, I don't like the snowflakes kicking up here, starting. It's uh, not a good sign. Whoa. Yeah, I've got a blizzard coming up. It's not good for our visibility. This might be a bad place to get stuck in a blizzard. Super tired. Can't really see. We could just walk off one of the edges here <laughs> if we're not careful. Got another bridge. Okay, another rickety bridge coming right up. Oh, I know why we're heavy. We picked up that climbing rope. That's why we're so slow and heavy. That thing's got to be really heavy. Oh gosh. It's so nerve-wracking. I can't really use moving. I have to kind of adjust as we go so I don't fall. I'm not even gonna look down. It's so freaky. Okay, we made it. I don't mind looking back. But, uh, <laughs> that is pretty trippy. Anyway, is this a dead end? It's kind of a sheltered spot, maybe. Yeah, I got some wood. I'm gonna grab it. We might need it. I don't think I have any fuel. I lay down and have a can't, sleep right here. I can't remember if we used all our coal or if we dropped it all. Super tired though. We're so tired. Let's see, are we sheltered here? Not really. No, I mean a little bit. I wouldn't want to sleep here. Like, I don't think we could sleep here. Like, yeah, I think we'd get cold. Alright, on we go then. What do we have here? A log? I hope it wasn't a bad idea to push on from that cave. Got some good shelter there. And uh, it's, it's pretty far back there. I don't think I could turn around. We just have to hope that up ahead we got some kind of little alcove or a cave or something. I'm just gonna check all these little nooks and crannies. See if we have any kind of shelter.
Haven't heard any wolves for a while, so that's encouraging. Wolf's Jaw Overlook. So maybe that rock really was Wolf's Jaw? Now is this... Oh, there's another arrow. I, I totally missed that. I was going to say, I want to find some kind of place to rest up. This might be just the place here. Another arrow. some firewood I will take that this is kind of secluded and I don't think I want to sleep here let's uh, see if we can climb this yeah we definitely are tired is there anything up here we're taking all right on we go This might be our stopping point. Like I, it seems pretty sheltered right here. I'm just gonna push on a little bit and see what we find. I mean, this does feel pretty secluded. But uh, it'd be a shame if I, <laughs> if I, kind of hunker down right in a crevice and then just r around the corner there's actually a cave. That would be just my luck. Okay, we got some trees here. Might be some more sticks. Yeah, we'll take that. Is that a cave? We're so tired and the wind is blowing at us. Something going on. I can see something there. I'm just gonna check these corners. Oh, I got some kind of uh, box. Hidden cash. Okay. Got a hidden cash. I'll take it. Right. Nice. I mean, the ski gloves are pretty good. They're pretty peed up. I mean, this is pretty secluded. Got some good, uh, good shelter right here. Let's see what this cave is. Doesn't look like a real cave. Like, it, you know, we can see all the way through it. What do we have here? Stones. We don't need stones. We will take the wood. I'm not going to be able to carry this load for much longer. Ah, it's getting dark. It's hard to see. Should I light a uh, torch? Just makes it a little bit nicer for you guys being able to see. If it gets much darker, I think I'll light a torch. Uh, fortunately, I think the. I thought it was going to be a blizzard, but it actually is not looking too bad right now. Another sign. And uh, looks like it's directing us that way. I do want to kind of peek over here. Yeah, it's definitely a dead end right here. What is that? Man, we're so high up. It's not going to let us map. I'm not even going to try. Okay, I'm still hoping for some kind of little cave. Or something.
It's getting pretty dark. I think I will light a torch. There we go. That's so much better. You can see a lot better now. This looks so much like uh, Bryce Canyon National Park. The Navajo, Navajo Trail, I think is what it's called. Just reminds me of that little... Okay, now, I think... I think this is... Somewhere around here, I think they have hidden um, stims. So I want to keep my eye out. Like, I've seen people play this, and they come through, like, a little place like that. And uh, developers will leave a stim hiding somewhere. So, keep your eyes out for stims, guys. <laughs> and what do we have here? A cave. Lovely. That is just what we needed. So we are heavy. I'm going to grab these since we're already heavy. And we're probably going to bed down for the night here. What do we have? Seems like a decent little cave. We got another climbing rope and some uh, cedar wood. I guess I didn't need to haul that climbing rope all the way up here. Let's drop our climbing rope. It's so heavy. Yeah, feels good. How far back does this go? Got another flare. Got some coal. That's really good. We probably don't even need to make a fire. I think it's, uh, it's going to be warm enough back here. We could just uh, put a bedroll down. There we are. Okay, let's drink up and uh, see if we have any food. Got lots of... Uh, oh yeah, we got the meat. Forgot we had that. I didn't want to... Don't want to carry that. Don't want to attract wolves. Okay, are these all the same? They're all, yeah, it looks like it. We'll go ahead and eat one of these. And drink up. Nice. Let's go ahead and bed down for the night. I'm going to sleep for 12 hours, just so we keep our, um, our energy. And I don't care if our torch burns out there, there's, maybe it already burned out, I don't remember. Pick that up, and uh, it's nice we can be able to see in the daytime. And, oh yeah, we're thirsty. Let's go ahead and drink up. Okay, now why, why are we so tired? Like, can you see in the corner? Is that because of the parasites right here? What is that? Is it because of the parasites? So there's that. It's got to be because of that. You will continue to weaken until treatment has run its full course. Oh. Okay. That's not good. Well, let's take another pill. Let's take five of them. <laughs> I think it only lets you take one a day. But, uh, make sure. I, I went ahead and grabbed both bottles just to make sure I didn't accidentally run out. Both bottles of antibiotics. Let's go ahead and use that. Ok, 
Okay, five out of ten doses remaining. Maximum one dose per day. Okay, um, we do want a, at least one rope. I can barely walk with this much gear. I just don't know what's coming up. Um, I think what so if we come to the ghost town, if we get that far, we could use a rope there. So that's. Do you know that's a good thing to have the rope for? It's a nice day. I'm gonna go ahead and eat some food. Might help us lighten up a bit. Thirty-five percent. No, that's not good. Let's eat that. I wonder what happens if you have a straight diet of maple syrup for like a week if you eat nothing but maple syrup. No, it can't be good. Beautiful morning, guys. I'm just going to look over here. I think that's the right way because it seems like it's keeping us right by the ledge but uh, I don't know the corner seems to be where the loot's hidden all right what do we have here this looks like mining equipment we might be here guys what is this I think this is it. This looks like mining equipment. There we are. A little, little ghost town or something like that. Some kind of structures down there. So I'm pretty sure this is it. Put the rope up here. Be cool if you could attach the rope there. These look, these look like rope bearing. Yeah, we can put the rope right here. Let's get down low. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna look around just a little bit. Probably don't need those. Boy, it feels good to get rid of that rope. I can already tell a difference. Okay, so here's the problem, we are heavy. And uh, if we want to go down that rope, I gotta drop stuff. I'm gonna look around a little bit. I think we're gonna end up just. Can we make it down there? Nice if we could just billy goat our way down. And uh, I, I know guys can do it, I've seen people do stuff like that, so. I try. Where is a good place to billy goat? Maybe over here. What's this? I think this is a good spot right here. Yeah, that's gonna work just fine. Oh, okay. Crouch down. Looks like we got some rabbits. Nice guys, I'm so excited. We have made it to the ghost town, if that's what you can call it. Some kind of little old mining remains. Oh, just what I didn't want to happen. You know what? I'm just gonna stand up. If you're gonna if you're gonna get a sprain while I'm trying to be careful, then I'm just gonna stand up. Oh, more sprains. Alright, so there's our rope climb. And we're in no condition to rope climb. <laughs> we just got all those sprains. But uh, we can have a look around. Hopefully there's no wolves in the immediate area. Hello there, rabbit. Do we want a rabbit? 
We might need a rabbit. I don't know what kind of food we have. Oh, well, that's no good. Don't know what kind of food we're going to find here. Maybe just cattails. Uh, I'll go ahead and treat her pain. Okay, so I have pain pills. Left hand and right foot. Alright. Clear things up a little bit. Alright, this looks like a pretty cool little town. I haven't seen any wolves. Maybe I'll grab these, uh, I'll grab these uh, saplings. We'll drop them inside the mine. Got some crows over here. Let's see what these guys are flying above. You can hear the waterfall. We must be right above one of the waterfalls. Now we got a dead guy. How did you get here? Oh. That was definitely worth it. Thank you. Thank you for that. Let's go ahead and map this. I don't want to go down there if I can't get back up though. Nice. So we got the waterfall here. Let's head back to the little mining town. Have a look around. If I can get up here, I'm gonna have to step over you. very secluded spot. I mean, that took a lot to get up here. This is a very, very isolated part of the map. And uh, this is the first structure. It's the first structure we've come across, I think, on this level. This, uh, ter this part of the map. Territory, that's the word I'm thinking of. Go ahead and map this. Plastic container. Well, that's pretty cool. It's like the shoot for the gold sleuth is that what they call that gold gold sluice that's it sluice box or something or uh, mining cars 
Very cool. I want to find that plastic container. Some very cool old mining equipment. Uh, I'm not seeing the plastic container though. Well, let's head over here. Maybe it's in this direction. There's our gold mine. There it is, guys. Okay, I'm going to look around real quick for the plastic container, and then we're going to go inside. Yeah, I don't know where they put that. Let's take a look at the map. Uh, is this it? Okay. Here we are. Okay, so it's it's on that side of the water. So I'll head back this way. And we may as well map right here by this mine, too. Let's get that on the map. That looks awesome. That looks so cool. Alright, let's map this up. Gold mine. Mining camp, that's what this is called. I kept thinking it was like a ghost town. It looks like a ghost town. I haven't seen any wolves, so I'm going to put that away. Okay, so plastic containers. Now, was it over here? Did I miss it? Let's walk around this structure. I'm just not seeing a plastic container. Is that it? There it is. Nothing. All that for nothing. Alright. Cold mine it is. I could do an Indiana Jones and climb in here and right through the mine. That'd be cool. Pretty cool. Okay, guys, we are going into the gold mine. I'm so excited. That looks cool. Gold mine, Ash Canyon. New location discovered. All right, let's have a quick look. Made it into the gold mine. I wonder if there's any gold. That's so cool. Oh, I love it. Love it. Heading into the ground. Okay. Well, this is a good place to call in an episode, guys. Uh, man, I'm looking forward to the next episode. We get to explore the gold mine. Somewhere in here, there is the prize. The tactical pack backpack or whatever it's called. Some kind of big backpack that's going to give us extra weight capacity. Um, there's also crampons in here, which helps you to have better traction on ice and climbing ropes and stuff like that. Um, so those are also pretty good. Um, but with the most recent update, you could actually craft your own uh, makeshift crampons. So it's not quite as rare of an item now. Um, but it's still pretty cool. But the main thing, main reason why we are here is for that backpack. So... Looking forward to the next episode. We are going to continue right where we left off. And I hope you come along with me. If you had a good time, let me know. Leave a comment. Leave a thumbs up if you're if you're willing to. I'd sure appreciate it. And uh, 
Anyway, this is Sprocket saying thanks for coming along with me, and I hope to catch you in the next episode. Take care. Thank you.